done a beautiful, warm, sun-kissed look, very summery. Evened out skin tone, we, we've used a new uh, bronzing blush from MAC, and we've just done that in the apple, sculpt underneath the cheekbone. We've contoured the eyes with cork, with bamboo on the lid, giving a really soft, smoky effect, filling in eyebrows and brushing, and just a little bit of highlight on top of the brow and on top of the cheekbone. So the overall look is very natural, fresh and summery. The look that we're doing for Ferragamo for Spring Summer 2015 is something that's very elegant, very minimal. Uh, feels very right to do it now. Um, it feels very modern. Uh, the girls look super beautiful. Um, and what we're doing is um, we're giving the girls a really nice silhouette because of the proportions of the clothes and the silhouette also uh, of the girls in the clothes. We kind of wanted to give them a neck. I wanted the girls to feel extremely elegant, almost as if they were balancing books on their heads to kind of walk really proper and very kind of poised in a sense. Um, so we tried hair down at the hair and makeup test, it didn't work and we pulled the hair back and we kind of gave them this small head and it just looks super beautiful. No fuss, really simple and really easy for women to recreate at home as well. Tell me about your new collection for Salvatore Ferragamo. It's a spring-summer collection extremely intense, where the idea of uh, materials uh, and uh, workmanship, it's really the uh, base, the, the core of this uh, spring-summer collection. Uh, um, the mood started from the archives, uh, from the idea of uh, Salvatore Fragamo in, uh, in the 40s. It's like celebrating one of the most iconic uh, shoes inside the Fragamo world, Rainbow, and the idea of uh, wedges. Uh, of course, it's a link between the, the past, the, uh, the archives, the celebration of, uh, of the brand, and of course, uh, contemporary modern women. I really love the idea of uh, keeping the silhouette of the ready to wear extremely clean and, uh, and simple, a very fortish inspired uh, silhouette with a lot of uh, workmanship, uh, uh, prints, uh, knitwear, but still the focus is on uh, accessory, the core business side of Salvatore Fragamo. Colors are very uh, intense. Uh, it's the idea of uh, using uh, primary colors, like in the, in the 40s. So we have uh, a neutral base of uh, beiges, uh, of white and black. And inside that, we injected a uh, yellow, of, uh, bright orange, very like the, the oranges uh, in, uh, in summer in, uh, in Sicily. Uh, citrus uh, yellow and uh, green and uh, deep blue, but also very mixed together with the, uh, with the neutral uh, base of the shoes and of course of the, of the red wear. I love this, the fact that we, uh, we kept the, uh, the shoes, the, uh, the wedges, the platform, always very um, neutral in colors, uh, linking uh, cork, very simple material, uh, materials that are really impressed uh, and uh, Salvatore Fragamo loved uh, coming back from the United States uh, and approaching uh, Florence, the, uh, the countryside of Florence, so famous for the, uh, the weaving, the uh, uh, the paglia, the very simple materials, and from the other side, extremely precious uh, details made of uh, lizard, uh, snake skin, uh, but really subtle uh, to make, uh, you know, emphasizing at the, the best and uh, always making uh, this woman uh, very aristocratic in, uh, in her sometimes uh, craziness and, uh, and creativity. <laughs> 